You can't build the Eiffel Tower in a day. You're working, with, you're working with wild animals when you're working with nerves. And it's through repetitious practice, you're able to develop a trained reflex pattern. But you first have the idea precedes your eventuality. You gotta have that mental picture of the, the members of, of the body that's moving in what sequence and what degree, okay? I just don't know how to produce the speed. I feel like I'm strong enough oh, to be able to make these motions. I just don't know how to make well, it's, the motion. You have no problem getting there within a year, in my opinion. Right now, what I would like for you to do is don't be afraid to come more off the ball. More off of it. Don't be afraid to shift off and then shift through. Yeah, look here. Let me show what you did. Shift over here. No. Stand on top of me with this crippled foot. I'll hold you at the both of them, just like that. Well, how in the hell can you hold somebody up that way? Well, now your head's behind your foot. Your, your head is behind this foot. Okay. Want, let me do something to you. Back. Let me do something to you. Now, you don't do a damn thing. Let me do it. Okay. Okay. Keep your head on the center line. Okay. There. Now, hold it right there. I want to show you what to do. Okay. Now, I want you to wind this muscle. Okay, your head didn't drop. Mm -hmm. Now, shift. Straight ahead. Now. Wind up that muscle. This way. That's right. You've got to practice that. Is, you see, you've got to know, work against what you've been ingraining. Mm -hmm. See, you've ingrained a posterior. This is a posterior rotation of the right hip, and it keeps your left hip here, and they're, they're like that. Now, when you move this way, this is dropping. Your head doesn't drop. Your shoulders turns down. Okay. You see, I'm not getting here and turning my shoulders like that. I'm coming underneath. I'm coming underneath. That's good. Now come. Yeah. 